Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am here with a wedding subscription box. This is the ring box. This is my fifth one. Um, I received this in May, June. I don't know. I have one more after this. Actually, I was sitting next to me um, to film an unboxing of that one also. And that will be my last one because I only did a six month subscription. But this is the ring box. I will have all the information for this link down below if you're interested, if you are a bride to be like myself. But this is what the box looks like for this month. I have already opened this because um, I filmed a video on it a few weeks ago, but I was not happy with the quality, so I am refilming this. Um, so unfortunately, my expressions won't be a surprise, but my thoughts will be honest, of course, as always. But the first thing we have in here is this little hat. It is this navy blue, and it says Future Misses. I think that the color is really, really nice. I like the print on it. Um, however, I've been getting so many, so many hats from these um, bridal subscription boxes. I have a gray one, a white one, a black one, now I have a blue one, and it's fine, but they'll say something like future misses. Um, I think I only have one that actually says misses. The rest is like bride or bride-to-be. So it's like a limited time period that you can wear it. I have a pretty long engagement. It was about, I wanna say 16 months, or that's how long it's going to be until our actual wedding day. We are less than a year away at this point, but if someone has a really quick engagement, then this wouldn't really work for them because they won't have a chance to wear it. But this is what the hat looks like this month, and I'm gonna go ahead and take it off for the rest of the video so I don't have hat hair. And then next up, I have this little camping mug that says Future Misses as well. Really, really cute, it's at tin or aluminum, I'm not quite sure, but it's what people use when they're camping. I don't camp, so I can't really like speak to what this is made out of. I just know this is what people use when they camp. But it's really cute. Um, I do like it if I don't use it for drinking, um, because like I said, I don't camp. I don't know, I'm sure this can't, this can't go in the microwave because it's metal, so you'd have to heat your beverage up on the stove, like your hot chocolate on the stove, and then drink out of it that way. Otherwise, I'll just use it to hold pens but it's really cute next up the shirt i have is again this navy blue color and then it says future misses and it's a v-neck i do get them oversized so i can tie up the bottom and make them look cute and this one is really soft i think it would be a really cute pajama top actually next up we have this giant straw that says bride it's one of those crazy straws but it does say bride I'm not sure if you can see that. So that's pretty fun. That reminds me of like being a kid with the crazy straws. We also have this little box. It says Sterling Silver Heart Earrings. Um, this one I'm a little upset about because I did receive this exact same pair of earrings in one of my last boxes from them. And they're not even silver, they're a rose gold. So it's a little upsetting that I received literally the exact same product. Um, I'm not sure who does quality control for them, but that might be something they might want to look into um, because I'm not trying to pay to get the same thing twice. Like, I love these earrings. I wear them all the time. However, I don't need two sets of them. So that's kind of a bummer. And then the last product that I have is a sterling silver ring, which says love. And it's not in the box because I'm wearing it. I forgot that I was wearing it. It's really, really cute. I like it. And it's adjustable, says love. And then it has like a little diamond right here or a little gemstone. And I just wear it on my pinky finger. So I do really like that. And then, of course, I received the little booklet talking about everything that was included inside um, all the information to tag their handles on social media, their hashtags that they use. So overall, this was not my favorite ring box because, you know, I received the same product and I received another hat and I now have four bridal hats and that's fine. Whatever, it's cool. I do really like the ring. I wear it all the time. I like the shirt a lot and I do really like the mug even though I don't camp. So thank you to the ring boxes. I 
do look forward to receiving these and I'm excited to see what is in my sixth and final box. So if you're curious about that, then make sure you stay up to date on my channel to be ready when that launches. And I will talk to you guys very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye guys. If a picture's worth a thousand words, I'll paint an invitation to let you in.